We are monitoring developments out of Craven County tonight. We're learning new information about that burned body discovered last night. Nine of your signs, Brandon Truitt has been on top of this story all afternoon. Brandon, what can you tell us tonight? Ken and Shayla, I just got off of the phone with Craven County Sheriff's Office about an hour ago, and deputies were asking the public to be on the lookout for 21-year-old Peter Shocker earlier today. Tonight, we now know Shocker and another person have been arrested in connection with the murder. Sheriff Hughes telling me the body has also been identified, and they're waiting to release the name until next of kin are notified. The victim was from Rural Hall, North Carolina. That's near Winston-Salem. And the sheriff says the second suspect is also from Forsyth County. He is currently in custody there. Now, here's where the case gets even more disturbing. Hugh says they believe the victim was murdered in Forsyth County before being brought to Craven County, where he was ultimately burned. We know this all happened last night around 1145, and since then, the Craven and Forsyth County Sheriff's offices have been working this case together. Peter Shocker has been charged with accessory to murder, while the second suspect has not been identified yet. So far, authorities have not identified the relationship between the two suspects or the connection to the victim. We're waiting to learn a motive for this as the investigation continues tonight. And guys, it's a lot to put together here as it's coming in, but we've put it up on our website, WNC. T.com. Really disturbing, though. It really is. Brandon Truitt with the latest on this breaking news. Brandon, thanks.